In this video, I will show you how you can configure auto formatting in Visual Studio Code so that you can become more productive when coding in Python. First, I will show you live before auto formatting and then we will configure our IDE to use uh, black to allow us to use auto formatting shortcuts and we'll tell our IDE to use this dependency and then we'll auto format our code. To follow along this tutorial, you will need to watch my previous video on configuring uh, the Python interpreter in Visual Studio Code. So please make sure you watch that before uh, continuing this video. So live before auto formatting. Without auto formatting, um, our code base can get to an inconsistent style where sometimes we use single quotes, sometimes we use double quotes, and sometimes we have white spaces, sometimes we don't. Whether you're working alone or whether you're working in a team, the coding style will drift over time. Our code base will become quite messy and hard to read. And we either live with that and let code become messy or we have to every time uh, kind of fix things manually one by one. And that's just very tedious. So let's see how auto formatting can solve this problem. Let's first install um, this dependency. We will use black, so I'll add it to my requirements text. Now make sure my virtual environment is activated. If not, I can run this command to activate it. And let's install the dependencies. And now that's done, we can tell our ID to use this dependency. To do this, we'll press F1 open settings. Let's open it in JSON. And anywhere within this JSON object, you can add this key value pair to say Python formatting provider use black. And now when we come to our code base, we can simply hit shift option F and our code is auto formatted. All the codes are consistent. The number of spaces is also consistent now. And here I have a very long function which was above 80 characters and it's generally hard to read. You have to scroll left and right and it's quite distracting. Now it's neatly formatted for you. And you can even configure your IDE to format on save so that with every save, every file is continuously being polished and kept in a neat and consistent state. So let's see how you can configure your IDE to format on save. Let's open our command palette, look for the settings, and we've already seen the JSON settings, so now, now I want to show you the UI settings. It's the same thing, but just in a different um, UI. Let's look for format on save, and you want to make sure you check this. If it's unchecked, check it. And now, every file, the moment you hit save, I now I'm going to hit command S, the moment is safe. And with this configured, you have an easy way to make sure that your code base is always in a consistent state. And instead of wasting time and mental resources on uh, fixing commas and codes and white spaces, um, you are free, your brain is freed up to solve the problem that you actually want to solve. 